So we got that one. Mm-hmm. And then uh, we got this one here. You hold on an E7 sus4 chord like this. And do all downstrokes in one direction like this. Mm-hmm. And then all upstrokes. And then the both down and up like this. Okay, so you're you're stiffening up your thumb a little bit. You want to keep it loose like this. You want to go like this. That's a little better. There you go. You know how about a, a, uh, non adjacent strings like this? That's good. Okay. Now, that we're, with that in mind, we're skipping strings that are not next to each other, right? Yeah. So you want to do it with a pick and middle finger like this. Oh, that's right. Good. Now the ring finger. So you're going to go like this. There you go. Now pick two three is like this. And now four fingers like this. Very good. Now let me give you a sheet to practice here. Okay, take a look at this here. I think you've given me the paper for this before. All right. This one? Yeah. So we're doing the first one, six, four, three, two, but we're picking fingers like this.
can't seem to get these windows. There we go. All right, so the first one, we're going to use picking fingers like this. You're going. Okay, the second one is a C chord, so we're going like this. Yeah, but my cord is worn out, so it doesn't really. All right. Well, oh, I can use a acoustic if we're not going to be doing cord stuff. So we're doing the second one. sheet here.
Okay, so let's do this one down here. Okay, so we're gonna, I just hold down like a D chord. So the strings are four, three, two, one. So the first one, uh, we did pick two, right? Pick three, we did pick two, three. Now, if you go back to that E7 sus chord, you can get all those three three note ones like that. You got, you got pick two with a uh, non-adjacent strings like this. And pick three. Two, three. Now some new ones here. We got a new one here. We got this one here. And then all the others. So we did pick two, three like this, right? Now we reverse this to go to pick three, two. Here's a good one. Pick three, two, pick three. That's kind of a staggered rhythm like this. the other finger so we got pick two four like this yeah pretty good there Pick four, two, pick four. Very, very good. And now, um, now we go back to our like C chord or D chord, anything with four adjacent strings on there. We got pick two, three, four. Pick two, four, three. What chord are you playing right now? Uh, number three dot seven three. Three dot seven three. Uh, okay, pick two, four, three. Now, do you have this sheet? I think so. Because I have a staple one. Basic right hand picking. Yeah, I do.
Do it again. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so then we got pick three, two, four. We're doing a C chord. Pick three, four, two. Number three dot seven six, pick four two three. Seven seven, pick four. Three, two. You can do the whole thing with that. that like this. Three dot seven eight is back and forth. Just natural a 3.79 stuff um 
I'm gonna have to cut my nails for this technique or because I'm used to like classical guitar so I try to keep them up just do it on classical then okay do it on your nylon string you got that handy huh Did you know uh, yeah You know what that pattern is for is this boxing, you know. Piece, which one? It's a lot. It's called Preludium. Maybe once, but it doesn't sound too familiar. That uses that pattern on uh, 379. Hmm. Okay, pick 432, pick 4, pick. So that's. to play Malaguena? Nope. You know that one? It sounds familiar, yeah. What? Sounds familiar. Is this a partial E chord? Watch this, watch this. Watch this. Oh, that's 
that's what you mean by okay, partial equal. Yeah, so you're doing this. Write it out for you. Okay. One more. repeats on here okay so this first part what's the name of that chord then the, or guess it's just part of an e chord goes to a part of an a minor okay so you just call it partial e or something is that well, it's e or a minor but you're not okay. playing the whole yeah. chord you're playing only part only yeah. okay. several of the notes of it Repeat. Good. And then, no. Try it 
Try that again. You got all kinds of wrong notes going on here. Okay, so. Oh, okay. Yeah, should be one more. <laughs> Let me make this better. Let me give you a new one. Try this one again here, hold on. This will be better. Repeats from here. These techniques help at all if I was to like start playing bass or it's all the same. Four strings of the bass are the bottom four strings of the guitar. Do you use a pick on bass or just your fingers? You can use both. A lot of bass players use a pick, man. Hmm. A lot of bass players use a pick. So yeah. 
Okay, we're running out of time here. Okay, man. I'll see you next week then. Mm -hmm. Yep. Good job. Good job. Sure.